It's a ticket Barry Rubholt says should have never been written. I knew that there was no you know, regulation to be parking on that side of the street, so I knew that it was a wrongful ticket right away when I saw it. Ticket was written early Saturday morning at the corner of Allen and Franklin. The violation, parking in a bus zone. The only problem, the bus zone is on the other side of the street. Barry says on the day he received his ticket, he counted as many as 12 other cars on the same side of the road were ticketed as well. Meanwhile, the other side of the street where the bus route actually sits, those cars remained untouched. It was a two separate issues, like one issue being the ticket that I knew could get dropped. The other issue, I wanted to inform the person and their supervisor that, you know, it was a wrongful ticket and hopefully they could, you know, work it out and they could pass the message to stop doing this in the future. Barry says a supervisor at the Dart Street impound lot was able to clear the incorrectly issued ticket, but was told the drivers would have to follow up on their own. So that definitely bothered me, maybe even more so than getting the ticket. Seven Eyewitness News reached out to the folks at the impound lot, as well as Parking Commissioner Kevin Helfer and the city spokesman. And just about an hour before the story was set to hit air, Seven Eyewitness News was notified that the other dozen cars ticketed on the odd side of the road would have their tickets voided. A spokesman with the city says they work to correct errors committed and that this is the first time that stretch of road has received citations. So what does Barry say he's learned from the situation? He says first, don't be afraid to fight the ticket. Take photos of the signs and the ticket itself and lastly, keep a name of everyone you talk to while you're disputing that ticket. In Buffalo, Sierra Johnson, 7 Eyewitness News.